So after Hurricane Harvey, supplies are still arriving in the state from around the country, and some are even coming with extra help. News 4 journalist Ricky Vasquez shows us how Sunnyside's JTED is pitching in. We have students here that are learning how to do construction. We are deciding, hey, what can we do? What can we do to make a difference with our skills and talents? We have a church that's been willing to put us up. We have a contact with a, an organization that already knows we're coming. They're expecting our help. Uh, we're hoping to have uh, our van paid for. Our, our goal right now is to raise $6,300 for our needs. I like carpentry a lot, like ripping down walls because there's a lot of mold on the walls, like ripping down walls. Um, but also concerned about electrical, like, because maybe there's still like five wires there. I took students to uh, Oklahoma when they had their tornadoes in Moore, Oklahoma, and built sheds for folks who had lost everything. Just the experience, the opportunity to connect with people, people I don't know, just stay humble. I really hope and pray that it'll be a really, it'll be a great blessing for them and hopefully a moment in their lives where they can see that it is really rewarding to, to give uh, more so than to receive.